Hello, uh, this is an instruction video for packing the e-module, sending it in for the 7 plus update. We need to have some tools, some allen key and some wrenches, but we're going to separate the e-module from the machine. So what we first do is that we take the display, this one, and then we take the hoses, LCD, and we unscrew the BOV from the loop and then we just unscrew the first stages of the tanks. So we're going to take the E-module off the unit. And this is the air and this is the diligent. And then we unscrew this screw and this screw and then we just lift all the electronics and all the sensitive parts here inside. Then we can move this one here. So what we want you to send in <coughs> for the update is the display, the hood and the e-module with the battery. So we need to remove the BOV. We take the hood off the BOV. Be careful when you detach it here and don't just pull the cable easy going with unclicking the hood then you untangle this one here take it all the way back to the e-module like this and keep it attached to the e-module then we're going to remove the first stages, so we start with the HP sensor. This is the oxygen side. This is the HP sensor that comes off. Don't take off the angle or detach it from the E-module. You want it to still be attached to the E-module in that uh, end. We remove this HP sensor on the Dillion side and the same goes with this one, we keep the angle. If you have the inversion kit, you don't normally use the angles, then you just detach it from the first stages so it will be loose, but still attached to the E-module. We take a 30 millimeter key and we unscrew this one. So this one stays at home, at your place, and also unscrew the helium side, which will leave us with everything that should go should go into Poseidon service department for the update. So this one you leave at home, and this is what we're gonna send in. The display, the hood, the battery, everything attached still to the e-module and also the hoses like this. So please do not remove the hoses here and please do not remove the contacts here. If you have a M28 connected to your 7, then you have a cable. If it comes loose easily in this side, then you can remove it, of course. But if it's stuck and it still sits there, please remove it in this side and send in the cable together with the e-module. So in this case we have the display and if you can unscrew the M28 then you take it off. Otherwise you leave it in and send in the cable as is. When it comes to packing of the unit please be careful of packing it gently with the hood and also with the display and make sure that you remove the cells we don't want the cells to come to Sweden so you take this one out you detach it and then you take this one and attach this one like this so the cells you leave at home this is what it's looking like when you're packing it into the package that's going into the 7 plus update proceedings.
Thank you.